when you're ready let's close our eyes and take some nice deep breaths roll your shoulders back as you take each breath in roll that shoulders back nice and gently if you can of course just move in whatever way you can but just move so that you come into your body even though we've woken up and we've made it here maybe you're not fully in your body yet <laughs> So come into your body, just move in whatever way you want to, just to come into your body. And remember that your body is here to serve and support you in your mission <laughs> towards your vision. And as you take your next deep breath into your belly, I want you to call to mind your vision. the vision of what you want to do and where you want to go this is your business vision and maybe your vision is exactly the same as it has been all throughout this journey or maybe it's shifted somehow maybe there there are some little things that have snuck in you think actually yeah i'm adding them into that vision see if anything pops in for you or drops in really come back into that vision feel that vision become centered within you bringing it back to front of mind <laughs> as you think about that vision for your business and the steps that you've been taking so far Let's just look back over the last 12 weeks. The things that you've achieved towards that vision that you're working to. Whether the things that you've worked on towards it are strategic. You might have been planning your strategy towards it. You might have been doing some preparation or some research towards it which might not feel like you're moving very far towards it, but actually every, every business and every idea needs a strong foundation to have longevity and sustainability. You just look back over those 12 weeks of the things you've done. You might even had time to do some things towards it as well. Maybe you've already started to get visibility to it. You may have started talking about it, started sharing about it. You may even have had some people that have bought it. So just look back over this 12 weeks and recall some of those things, some of those steps that you've taken. And be proud of yourself for having taken them because you didn't have to. Even showing up here every morning, it's a step. It's a step in the right direction. Think of each of these mornings as another dot and you're do joining the dots each and every day. Another dot takes you closer to where you're going. And keep feeling those nice deep breaths filling your body. With each breath you take, your vision is becoming stronger and stronger, clearer and clearer. Even if you can't see it, just know that it is happening. It's happening in another realm, being drip fed to you. And I want you to imagine this beautiful, beautiful mountain that is right in front of you. It might be a mountain that you've climbed before. It might be your favorite mountain. It might be one of your favorite places, or it could be a mountain that you've never climbed before. This might be a brand new mountain. It's not a big mountain. It's one that you can see in all of its beauty and as you look up at this mountain, 
you can see that there's a little pathway that's going to lead you from where you are straight to the top. It's not a windy mountain. It's going to lead you straight to the top. And feel this incredible light flowing into your body, giving you all of the energy that you're going to need. You're not going to have to draw on the resources of your body. This light is filling your body right now with everything that you need to take you easily and with flow up that mountain in a way that you're going to enjoy getting to the summit. Now at the top of that mountain is one of the things that you would really love to achieve towards the vision of your business. And maybe it's a, a small thing that has lots of small things within the small thing for you to achieve it, or maybe it's a big thing. Maybe it's a big thing that you would really love to achieve in your business. It would be a great milestone in your business. It would take you a big leap forward for you to achieve this. I want you to imagine that that is at the top of the mountain. It's almost like it's waving at you saying, it's much easier than you think. Just take the first step. <laughs> it's calling down to you. And so to make this mountain climb easier, it's good to celebrate small steps along the way. And it also gives you a little breather <laughs> as you're making your way towards the top. So I want you to see five different resting points. We're going to call them resting points. So you might mark them out on your mountain with a coloured flag. So just see what colour your flags are going to be. I want you to place your first flag on the mountain. So we're going to walk towards that, that part on the mountain and you're going to glide. We're just going to glide. We're not going to walk. We're not going to do any hard work during this morning meditation. We're just going to glide towards that first point. You're going to place that flag. You're going to put it into the ground. So that's your first flag. I want you to imagine what that first flag stands for. What does that represent on this journey? What achievement is that going to be towards this great achievement getting to the top if you break it down into five steps what is this first step going to be what is the first thing you you know you're going to need to achieve towards you completing this whole journey like how will you know that you've completed it get that clear in your mind what it will look like what will it feel like once you've completed that step and how are you going to celebrate what one little thing are you going to do for yourself whether it's take a walk <laughs> you might have a little dance have a little dance on the spot to celebrate what are you going to do to celebrate I just want you to at this point imagine that while you're stood here at the the first point on this journey I want you to imagine that you're looking back to where you are right now sat wherever you are so you're going to look back at yourself from this first step of the mountain and just notice that step that you took just do a little review of some of the things that you did to get to that first step so it's almost like you're shouting back to yourself and saying, what you had to do to get here was this. So you're just giving yourself a little bit of personal guidance. Because you're now stepping into the future and shouting back to the you now about what you've got to do. So 
Now I want you to turn around, look back at the mountain, notice that next point towards you achieving this one thing. So what would the next point look like? Take your next flag, your next colored flag, whatever color that might be for you. And I want you to imagine that you're gliding up this next part of the mountain and you're gonna stop. And you're gonna place that next flag in the ground, your little marker. And think about what that next thing would be. So now you're gonna be two steps towards this thing that you want to achieve. So what would that look like? What would you need to have done for you to recognize that this is the next step, I've completed it? What does it look like? What, what will you need to do? And you're just gonna turn around and you're gonna shout back down <laughs> to yourself. Okay, here's what we had to do to get to this step. Just recount that. Let the you now know. What, what did you have to do? Or is there an easier way? Just look at what you've done there and just think to yourself, hmm, was there an easier way that I could have done that? So now we're going to come back to that point two. How are you going to celebrate? <laughs> what, what are you going to do to celebrate this second step? And just notice how it feels to now be two steps towards where you're going. I think one of the things that we can all be most guilty of is that we just see the to-do list and we just tick the to-do list off. We never take time to actually celebrate that small step, that next achievement. So now we're gonna look up at the mountain. The top is getting closer. You're getting nearer to the top. Now we're gonna look at where is that point on the mountain that represents your step three. And we're gonna take your next flag and we're going to just float. <laughs> we're going to float towards where you're going to put this next point on your mountain. And you're now halfway through your journey to achieving that one thing that would really move your business forward, that would really move you forward. So now we're halfway through. What would it need to look like halfway through to know that you're halfway towards achieving it? So just see yourself just floating effortlessly to that point, stick your flag in the ground and just mark out what, what, where would you need to be at this point for you to know that you're halfway towards the completion of this thing. What would halfway have to look like? What would you need to have achieved? What are some of the things you would have had to have done? just see yourself doing them and just see yourself doing them the easiest way if you're not sure what that easiest way is remember you can use the masterminds to ask those questions get help with that Again, you're just going to look down the mountain. You're going to call back to yourself. Here's what I had to do to do this. In fact, there might be some things now you're halfway through and you think, oh gosh, there's so much to do in this step. 
it might be that you just look back over the other steps and you can sprinkle some of the stuff <laughs> some of the things that you've you've now got to do because you're like shit i'm halfway instead of overloading yourself at step three are there a few things that you could take and maybe you could sprinkle those over step one and two to spread the load make it a bit easier for yourself we don't want to get stuck halfway up a mountain just see if there's an easier way for you to do it and spread that load and take a nice deep breath you've been on quite a journey already now come back to look at the mountain you're just two steps away from the top you can see it getting closer you can feel it getting nearer you can see this just most fabulous view from where you are what a journey it's been and maybe you've been so concentrated on the actual journey itself that you forgot to enjoy the view so maybe just let's just take a moment to enjoy the view and smell that beautiful fresh smell only mountains have that lovely lovely smell beautiful fresh clean air temperature cooler mm. so now we're going to look to that fourth step towards the top and what would you need to have done and achieved by step four for you to be really on track for you to be celebrating think about the things that you'll need to do in step four and just list them out for yourself at this point stick your flag in the ground if you haven't done that yet and then call back down to yourself here's what I had to do at step four <laughs> and just shout it down and tell your yourself now tell yourself here's what I had to do to get here Here's what to be aware of. Maybe there are some pitfalls. Maybe there are some things that, that weren't so easy in this step. Because you're getting so close to the end now. Maybe there's some fears or some little feelings that are bubbling up that you didn't have in the first few steps. You know, just notice any emotions that, that are coming up. And let, your, let yourself know. Here's what's coming up for you. Here's what, how you're going to feel. But here's how you can get through it. And give yourself some words of encouragement. You're so close to the top now. <laughs> and really feel that, that sense of achievement. And celebrate. What are you going to do to celebrate? You're so close to this goal now. Now we're going to look to the top, our fifth and final step to the destination. <laughs> and just see yourself with your fifth and final flag, just gently floating up the mountain to your destination. And here you are at the top of this mountain, looking back at the beauty and all of the journey even though you floated effortlessly up this one, you get to enjoy it. You get to look back and enjoy the view, the things that you've achieved along the way. And now this is your fifth and final flag. Take that flag, stick it in the ground and notice what are some of the things that you would need to have done and need to have completed for you to be at this fifth and final step, for you to know. How are you going to know that you've completed this mission that you set for yourself, this task? How will you know that it's done? What will be different? How will it change you or your business? Just notice, are there any other people at the top? 
any other people that are part of this thing that you set for yourself. And how are you going to celebrate? How are you going to celebrate this massive achievement? And remember to call back down to yourself. Here's what you had to do to get to step five. And here's how you can do it the easier way. And just notice at the start of that mountain, there's the you sat where you are right now, receiving all this information. Saying, thank you. <laughs> thank you for showing me the way. You've made it so much easier for me. <clears throat> and now knowing what those steps of the journey are and having plotted them out, you see yourself doing your little celebration at the top of the mountain. Enjoy the view for a bit. What is that view? What does it look like from up here? And you're not allowed to look at any other mountains at this point. You're just going to enjoy the one that you're on. And just while we're at the top, Let's just assess this mountain of value that you're now stood on. What value did you create along the way? What ripple of impact will be made because of this journey? What is the ripple effect of what you've done? Mm, now feel yourself floating back down from the top of the mountain, floating down, 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 back into your body, back into the place where you're sat right now. And take some nice deep breaths, come in, come in back into your body, having experienced this journey, having seen into the future, having taken those steps, having celebrated those steps at each point, and come back into your body and roll your shoulders, roll your neck nice and gently, roll it nice and gently, now back the other way. Taking some nice deep breaths, coming back into your body, and we're going to come back now into the room. Three, two, one, open your eyes. Let's take a few minutes to journal out what that journey looked like this morning. What steps did you take? What did you achieve? How did you celebrate? And we'll come back in a few minutes.
until next time have fun enjoy being the one drop you want to see in the world and i will see you again very soon <laughs>